In this video, I'm going to show you how to connect CTrader to TradingView. So the first thing you want to do is you want to go to tradingview.com and you want to sign into your account. And then once you've done this, of course, you will also need a CTrader account, which can be connected to TradingView. OK, so this means you need a broker which actually can connect to CTrader. So, uh, of course, you can do this. For example, with IC Markets, Pepperstone, Black Bull, or some other accounts as well. And of course, a demo account is also going to be fine for any of those instances. Okay, so let me now show you how to do this. Over here, you want to go to Products and click on Super Charts. Now, of course, in case you are trying to do this, uh, it's not going to let you to just simply connect to CTrader. And what you want to do is you want to click on Trading Panel over here down below. Once you do this, you want to look for one of those I just told you about. So it's going to be uh, any of the ones I said, either IC Markets, Pepperstone, Black Bull, whatever will do. But for me, I'm just going to connect with Pepperstone right now. So here you want to click on connect. And then this is going to basically take you to one of their websites. There we go. And then you will have to sign in with your account on their website over here. So it's going to start loading. There we go. You're going to see the connect icon. And then there we go, you're going to see you'll be able to create a trading view demo account. So for me, I'm inside Pepperstone. Of course, it may be different for whatever you're using. Um, but of course, this one is how it looks. So I'm going to do submit over here. And I'm going to create a trading view account. And then there we go. As you can see, this is not working. And I can now continue to trading view. So if I press this, it's going to take me to trading view. And now I have successfully connected myself a pepper stone over here. Okay, so as you can see, you can now just start whatever you're doing. But as I said, um, as you can see, it says it's connected in another tab. So I'm going to go over here. And yes, there we go. We're now connected. So once you do this, once you're actually connected inside trading view, and you've successfully connected to whatever broker you actually had over here, you can then simply go ahead and then you can start placing your trades. Okay, so um, after you do this, you can of course, just place trades directly through trading view over here. And then you can also copy trades to other accounts. Okay. So if you want to actually go over to C trader, here's what you're going to have to do. Um, you have to basically uh, add your account to one of the tools which allow kind of bridging. Okay, so the one of the tools is called metacopier.io. So you can just go to them, but they also have a lot of different, um, there's a lot of different websites which can do this. But of course, you can just copy the trades to other accounts using this metacopier.io, which is their official website over here. You can check this out. You can just copy trades using their services over here. So they support pretty much everything you could possibly want. So you just have to connect your account after you've done that. And then you'll be able to uh, essentially kind of interconnect C Trader with Trading View. So that's pretty much it. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please subscribe to the channel and help me out as well.